old were you when you first started learning about picking up trash or even pollution? Well, one children's book author says it's never too early to teach about Mother Earth. So why not make it fun for kids? Leslie is at Build-A-Bear Workshop to learn more about going green. Kids love their stuffed animals. And this group of them are called the Greensies. Based on a children's book by Lisa Kaiser, these animals are out to help the planet. We're finding that the tweens and even the teens are Facebook fans and they're buying them and they love them as well. So it's something that kids should get on board with early. And I want everybody to take a heart. They can read the book. They can also look at the tips in the back of the book. There are a lot of things that kids and parents can do together to make a difference. So sad. If everybody does their own small thing, even if it's, you know, just brushing your teeth with a small glass of water or making sure the refrigerator's shut. Those little things make a big difference if everybody would do it. Give them a hug, do you think? Feel good? What are they made out of that makes them eco-friendly? Soy. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. they're so soft. And they're very soft. Who would have thought that soy would be so soft? How did Greensies get started? Well, I'm a product designer. I had never designed a toy before, but um, I always wanted to and I thought, I think if I do one, I would like it to have some social value. And so I thought green because I do think it's one of the most important issues of our time. It's one of her favorite books for bedtime and you know I explained it on her level but I don't think it's ever too young to, to start learning about being green. They're kind of coming to me now and teaching me to be honest with you, you know, I guess so. Say so don't, you need to recycle a, that. You yeah, to, exactly, you know, you, you need to do this and mom do that and so it, it's kind of a turnaround and, and it's good, it's a good thing. It reminds me that, you know, we all need to really pay attention to the earth. Now you have a theme song already. Yes, we do. It's sung by Samaya Najimi Finnerty. She is the daughter of Kathy Najimi, and the song was written by Michael Orland, who is the musical producer for American Idol. It's gonna branch out into be a cartoon. I, I think that eventually will be the plan. Yeah, we're in talks for that already, but not yet. Of a lot of celebrities who are loving these stuffed I animals. I know. Well, we're also affiliated with the Environmental Media Association, and that is the Hollywood Green Charity, and so a lot of them come out to support that as well as the Greensies. Ed Begley Jr. is actually the Greensies family ambassador. He's on board with us. He's wonderful. And his wife, Rick, Rochelle Carson. Is having celebrities help help you out? I think so. I think having celebrities helps to create an, a more of an awareness. And with every purchase, a tree is planted by the Arbor Day Foundation. It's just important for kids to have an awareness and to hopefully adopt lifelong green habits. Thank you, Leslie. And so far, thousands of trees have been planted through the Greensies, and now you can help too. For more information, head to bettertv.com and click on the link.